Japanese emergency services and troops scrambled today to reach thousands of homes cut off by catastrophic flooding and landslides that have killed dozens and caused widespread damage. A 20-meter-high crane collapsed on a construction site and adjacent houses in East London yesterday, killing one person and injuring four. Police and protesters clashed with tear gas, flares and firecrackers in a second night of protest violence in Belgrade, where demonstrators are angry over the Serbian government's handling of the coronavirus pandemic. Markets and grocery stores reopened in the capital Khartoum as Sudan begins loosening lockdown measures in and around the capital after three months of tight restrictions due to the coronavirus pandemic.